Valentine's Day, January 22nd, 2022, the day you're getting married. An awfully cold day, but we all have warm hearts here today together, right? It's a wonderful occasion, right? And I'm sure yeah, you're, you're filled with hopes, you're filled with dreams and excitement, uh, looking forward to your future. And again, we are here today to celebrate the love that you, Rosa, and Gladstone have for each other. And to recognize and witness your decision to journey forward in life as marriage partner. Now what you promise to each other here today in a minute, it must be renewed again tomorrow and every day that follows. So, yes, at the end of this ceremony, legally, the two of you will be married. But still, you must decide each and every day to commit yourselves to one another. To this new family unit that you're creating. I ask that you make that decision and keep on making it. But one of life's greatest blessings is the two of you, and I think everyone here in this room already knows, is to love. And I always say, better yet, be loved. May we have the rings, please? Hey, okay, let's get a photo. Look at the camera. Look, ring lady. Ring bearer. There you go. You're part of this. Very good. All right. Very good. And I want you to now hold each other's ring. Don't hold the ring you're going to wear, but hold the ring you're going to give. The ring bearer. And realize that a ring is certainly a fitting symbol for a wedding promise, for it's a circle without beginning nor end. And love without end is certainly what we want in marriage, right? Always give the highest priority to the tenderness and kindness that this connection here deserves. And when, sadly the word is when, but it's realistic, when frustration, fear, or difficulty ever assails your relationship, always remember to focus on what is right between the two of you, and not only on that little part that may be seen wrong in that little particular moment. In this way you can ride out the storms when the clouds hide the face of the sun in your lives, remembering that even if you lose sight of the sun for a moment, it is always still there shining down upon you. And... I think what I'm about to say is the most important thing I have to say. And that is, if each of you takes responsibility for the quality of your life together, it'll then be marked by a lifetime of abundance, love, and joy. And so, the words you've been waiting to hear, because you've committed yourselves to each other in marriage, and you've demonstrated this by the exchanging of vows, and by the exchanging of rings, before witnesses and myself, by the power vested in me by this great state of New York, it is my privilege and truly my honor to officially and legally pronounce you husband and wife. Gladstone, you may kiss your bride. You are the flowers. Ciao. 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 Ciao.